what's going on guys it's letter havoc and we are back on sky factory and today we are gonna get a little more batania done yes but first things first i'm in the middle of doing something and i was like hey i've already done one of these i maybe i like could record and when i do my next one just in case you never made one of these they're freaking awesome uh they are <clears throat> the magnum torches I kind of like it because I don't have to keep like torches all around anymore. Uh, I can kind of while that's working. Um, oh, where I'm going? I got like the stuff sitting all over the place right now. Um, so I've got a magnum torch right here. It goes 64 blocks in uh, all directions this way, and it goes 32 up and down. It prevents mobs from spawning. But what's cool about it is it, it only lights the immediate area like a normal torch, but it does prevent spawning. So I don't have. Oh wow, you haven't seen any of this. Um, I don't have any torches anywhere around anymore because I hate torches. Oh yeah, that's all brand new too. Um, and the reason I'm making this one is actually to go put it down in the uh, uh, deep dark. Just so I can get stuff done down there if I need to move around or whatever. Uh, I want to be able to uh, do that freely and this will help me do so. Um, let's see. So I'm hoping after putting this guy in, it's not going to make a huge difference. Um, but, oh yeah, I can, I, I'm still happy that I can fly. Just in case you were wondering, uh, if it's lost its appeal, no, it has not. I, I'm still very happy that I can fly. Um, you know, as a matter of fact, I, know I just put it in the house. We'll light up the house, but then this will, uh, now prevent mobs from spawning inside the area. So if I can kill them all, like this Mr. Skeleton right here, yeah! Yeah, oh, oh, you're still alive? No way. Do the mobs... Okay, they got a lot of hearts. I'm thinking the mobs in the deep dark have some uh, crazy extra health. Because I've had zombies that took like like three shots with my sword, which doesn't seem like much unless you realize that uh, I'm doing freaking five and a half hearts of damage. So, yeah, I believe this one... I thought it was higher than that, actually, but it's got... <clears throat> Skeletons are so annoying. But anyways, yes, well, we're going to get back to, yeah, this. Okay. So, here's the deal. I want to get um, get some Terra Steel, and I want to start getting closer to um, getting some Elven Knowledge, as well as the Gaia Spirit, and there's a whole bunch of stuff I've been reading about. And the only way to do that is by progressing. And so, today, that's like kind of what I want to do is, well, I'm going to dump some of this stuff. Um, doo -doo -doo. Let me put that in there for right now. Um, starting, you know, going up. And obviously, I want to want some Terra Steel armor for uh, when we go to the Gaia Spirit. But uh, let me let me pull the old book out here. Um, so there's something in here. I believe it was... Miscellan was it miscellaneous? No. Okay. Last time I... F the way I found this last time was I uh, went to the Index... Where's the index? Options, challenge, challenges. How do I not know about challenges? Um, flower farm. Oh, well, yeah, got that. Mark completed. Oh, that's kind of cool. I've never noticed this before. Uh, record farm. Create a system that produces records through the depths of creepers and skeletons. Oh. Bonus points. Oh, intro. I mean, yeah, I know how to do that, but sure came farm. Yeah. Oh, automated. Nope. Sorry. Sorry. Not automated. Um, anyways, not worried about this right now. Uh, where's the index? The index. Um, Terra Steel. I forget the name of the thing that we need to make. Um, Terra Steel. All right. So this guy is the guy we got to make. I need three lapis blocks, one block of mana steel, uh, fire, air, uh, earth, water, and mana. That's easy peasy. Um, so let's get some lapis because I've got a ton and I think I'm going to need a total of three for that and then I'm going to need four for the platform itself. So I think seven is what I'm going to need. And um, let me go iron. Let me just grab an iron block, mana steel block, and then yeah, and then we can go make the other stuff over there. So as we're getting ready to head over there, I'll kind of show you. I got going on um, <coughs> immersive, uh, was it immersive engineers, immersive engineering. 
it's a lot of fun. I like it because of the look. Um, some of these multi-block structures are just really, really cool. And I'm really, really digging on them. And so I'm just having a lot of fun playing with them. Um, this thing I have yet to figure out. Because this one's working, but this one isn't. What is going on here? Oh, that might help. There we go. That works. All right. And then the creosote oil goes over here. And I don't have anything to check on it, but I can see the level. So we're good. Um, yeah, we will probably spend a little bit of time on that. But uh, for the right now, basically my power is coming from the sky. And I'm going to change that. I didn't have anything else to build with, but I really wanted to get some power going. I've got some two windmills up in the sky, and so I just pill it up with uh, dirt. But I will eventually change that out with some good blocks, so to make it look pretty and all that stuff. Um, but yeah, I've done a lot of things like I don't know. Just some of these blocks are really cool, and I think it just with the whole conveyor system and everything, it looks really really neat. Like I really enjoy, I'm really digging on it, and uh, yeah. So basically, I mean, I've got the system pretty well automated. Uh, the coal goes in here comes out as uh, coal coke and then I've got it piped over there's no way to pipe from the coke oven uh, or coke out of the po coke oven that I could tell I can pipe into it but I can't pipe out of it it was kind of annoying me but anyway so it's going from there and that and then it goes in there yeah and then uh, this one has these guys that are all powered up and anything goes in here it just speeds up the process a precharger or something like that I don't know anyways it's doing its thing and uh, I've got, you know, 40 blocks of steel in there, or iron in there. It's already made me uh, 19 blocks of steel. So it's it's a work in progress. And then I just thought this would be fun to kind of make this part of my uh, magical crops. So instead of doing my normal collection like I had been doing, I have a pipe up um, and it pops up on these conveyors uh, as soon as it farms it and then takes it into this tank right here. However... I literally just picked it all up and put it in there for the time being. But, uh, oh, I just, no? Okay, anyways. So, Batania. Yes, Batania. I've done some more building, as you can see. Um, I wanted to incorporate this building. I, oh, yeah, you, I don't even know if you noticed uh, that big old monstrosity is gone. And I reduced it down to a really small thing here. You can kind of see inside. I've got some, uh... Uh, what's called cursed earth in there uh, that I collected with my silk axe uh, actually hammer huh, which is funny um, but yeah basically they just spawn in here and you can see I'm getting pushed back I'm doing the fan thing again and then I've got some spikes over against this wall and I, I haven't figured I haven't come up with a way for useful collection yet because I haven't really got to go in on applied energistics but the whole point of this is I needed ender pearls that was the whole point. I wanted Ender Pearls. So I needed something that was at least three tall. And, uh, which this is. And then, um, I've got this little flower. Where are you at? You are called... This guy right here. Uh, basically pulls the Enderman in and doesn't let them leave. So, it's actually a, a interesting system because, because I do have that, uh, Magnum Torch nothing spawns but the, the cursed earth will so it was kind of useful because i realized once i put that down my system wasn't going to work but i like it because i don't have to worry about putting torches down all the time now it's so nice so so nice uh, anyway so terra steel i think we can get quite a bit done today because i have a lot of mana um why wow, you've drained that entire tank really why is nothing going right now Oh no, you have power. Why? Oh, you're just not going at the moment. I see. I see. Okay. Trees haven't grown. Um, I should probably check and see if they're still able to grow. I don't know. Anyways, I've got quite a bit of mana. As you can see, I've got one completely full tank, three very, you know, full tanks, um, three something tanks over here, and then a very full tank over here. And yeah, we'll just go through this door, I guess wasn't my intention but what are you anyways you are electrum okay and let's see and then i've got another uh relatively full tank in here and up here i've got a completely full tank and this is where we are going to be doing our ritual we're going to be putting it right over here 
So anyways, we got to get that plate made. And I don't know if I have... All I have is water right now. Um, did I... Oh yeah, because I used my air in the other one. So we got to make up a couple runes. Not a problem. Let's look these bad boys up real quick. Terra Steel. Let's go back to you. Terra Steel. There you are. Okay. I need you. So, first one. I got the water. So let's do Earth. Earth is stone, coal, and a mushroom with my normal two items. So I'm gonna need I'm gonna be doing four of these, so might as well just grab four of these each. Got coal, stones downstairs, and what kind of ingredient? Oh, a mushroom. And a mushroom. Alright. Hey, that's not right. You're where I'm trying to go. And I'm going to grab one piece of stone, and then let me just grab a stack of this. Not a stack, but whatever, ten of them. I've been doing so much building. I've had so much fun, though. So, so much fun. Um, okay, let's move all you guys out of the way and move you down into the right spots. There we go. And bingo, bango, bingo, boom, boom, yaha! And it's going, and it's going to get going. So that's Earth. While Earth is going, let's prep for the next one. So I'll just move you here. Earth requires, not Earth, this was Earth. Uh, air requires feather, string, and carpet. Carpet, string, and feather. Oh, I'm getting low on feathers. I need to check that out. I'm getting kind of low on diamonds, too. Oh, no, you know what? I just mined up a whole bunch. Never mind. Um, there we go. Batania takes up a lot of your inventory space. Um, okay, let's get the other one ready. What's the other one? The other one is fire, which is nether wart, gunpowder, and nether brick. Nether brick, gunpowder, nether wart. All right. And then I have a feeling that the mana one is like all of them. That just... It would just make sense to me. Um, oh no, just all mana steel and a mana pearl. Okay, so I need five more ingots. One, two, three, four, five. And a pearl. Oh, nope, I got one right there. There we go. All right, so we should get all this done pretty quickly. Oh, and do I got that block on me? Yes, I do. Let's go ahead and make the mana block just because why not instead of just putting the blocks together mm. oh ooh, you're ready aren't you you're ready you got lightning shooting at your wazoo oh i should probably grab my wand that would probably be helpful right now wandy wand there you go i just totally cleaned out my entire thing okay so next one is carpet string feather and there you go and you're doing your thing and you know what i'm gonna start what is the other material is it living rock um if i do this it is living stone okay so i've got the stone here we're gonna go build this really quick i think i think over here it's a three by three let me get my pick real quick hey not my axe my pick okay it's gonna be a three by three like so. I think that works. I think that'll work. I love that I can fly. Oh, it's so exciting. Uh, it's a checkerboard pattern, if I remember correctly. Yes, with the uh, middle block is that. Okay. So, it's you, 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 and you. And you, 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 and you. That's actually really pretty, like that. All right, and then the plate will go on top there. And then I need to get some sparks so I can share mana. There you go. All right, next one is you, you, and you. You, 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 and you. There we go. And... <coughs> Sparks, that's what I need to look. Actually, I'm going to have to go back to the house for that. I have a feeling. 
Uh, let's see. Let's see what the recipe is on that one. Uh, blaze, gold, and white mystical pellet. Let me grab some petals. I don't think it's any kind of petal, but uh, I have a bunch of white, so that works. Might make a couple of these, because I believe this helps them like share. So I can share from one to the next. I don't know if it goes up, down, or through blocks, but I mean, if anything, I know for sure it's going to uh, connect from that one mana pool. Okay, spark. Make you right there. There we go. One. What was that? What was the achievement? Live drive. Okay, if you say so. Mm. All right. I'm going to make a couple more just to see how these interconnect. And I think we're good there. And it's so dark. I, I really like that it's so dark. Like, oh, yeah, lampposts. I like these lampposts. I'm actually changing them out for a different one soon that puts out a little bit more light and uses electricity to do it, but I like them as they are. Okay, um, let me put a block here because the spark is actually going to be above that. Like so. Nope. Yeah, I can put you there. Okay, so it, it will only go above objects that can use it. Okay. I'm okay with that. Because we're going to have that plate in just a moment. You're done, right? You're still not done? You take a long time. Are you not sending mana over there? Is it going? Not going? It doesn't seem to be... Is that spark, like, interrupting something now? Let me... Let me take you away real quick. Are you like trying to steal? What are you doing? You're still not moving. Huh. It's very curious. So you're connected to the runic altar, right? Yeah. Why aren't you blasting? What is going on here? What's going on? Let me see. What's going on? Okay, it was fake done. Okay, not what I thought was about to happen, but sure. One, two, three, four, five, and mana pearl. That was interesting. Well, why not give it a click and try? Cool. So we have those. And. All right. Do that. And I don't need all of them. I just need one of each. And then the mana one. And then we should be good to go. Good to go. That one's going to take a little bit longer. Okay. So I don't think that spark had anything to do with it. I really don't. Just go like that and you should share over here once that's done right and like a zero loss if i read correctly all right and oh i'm so ready to make some freaking terra steel it's so expensive though it's one iron ingot it is what is going on over here why is my vacuum hopper not working right now oh look at all those ender pearls Oh wait, those are the ones I already had. It's still pushing me. It's still pushing me. Okay, I'm gonna have to go in and check on that uh, vacuum hopper. Um, I don't need the zombie head or the arrows or the bones or the creeper head or the rotten flesh. I'll keep the redstone and <laughs> chicken. That must have been a, uh, a baby zombie riding a chicken. Anyways, this should be about done. Oh, so I'll give you a little tour while we're waiting. Hold on. Let me make sure it's not done yet. Oh, no. Not 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 time for a tour. It's definitely time to get this done. Get some terra steel going. I want to be able to do at least at least 
the sword today, but I think I'm going to do a ton more. Okay, and that's only giving me one. All right, so it was like this, and this, and this, and this. No, actually, that was there. I actually remember exactly where they were at. That's kind of funny. Boom, got the plate. Cool. This little tiny plate. All that stuff I put in. A big old block of freaking man of steel and four, three blocks of lapis. And oh, that's awesome. Okay, let's try out our first one. So I'm going to need a mana diamond. And is it a mana pearl and iron? What is, it? is it a pearl? I think it's a pearl too. Um, pearl, iron, and diamond. Okay. So let's go ahead and do up a whole bunch of these. And I can go grab more iron and, or diamonds in a second. We'll make a whole bunch of mana pearls. Maybe I can get like a full set of armor or something. Who knows? Let's see. Alright, so I believe I just throw them on there and it just does its thing. Yep, it seems to be working. Except for the fact that I didn't put the spark above it, so I don't know if it has the mana. Did it just eat them up? Did I just waste all those? Is that what I just did? Did I just waste all those? Yeah, because I don't see any animations. Let's try that again. Let me grab a couple more. There we go. I think I just wasted all those. That is so sad. Let's make sure that these are connected. Yep. Yep. Okay. Okay. So it's you, you, and you. Something's definitely not right here. Okay. Let's double check this again. Because I know I did it. Okay. After the plate is set up and ready to receive mana, tossing a single mana steel ingot, mana diamond, and mana pearl on top of it will begin the infusion. Picking up any of the items will halt the infusion, causing severe mana loss. The infusion uses half a pool of mana total to create a single piece of terra steel. Multiple sparks would make it go faster too. Multiple sparks. Well, see the the problem with multiple sparks is the first one's not working. So what's going on? Is it not? Hold on. Did I not make the plate right? There it is. Okay. Visualize. I'm going to put it like right here so I can go see under and make sure it's the right block under. Yeah, it's living stone. Living stone, lapis, living stone. Yeah, no, it's totally right. Yeah, it's totally right. What is going on? I'm wondering if it could just be a laggy issue. I don't, I mean, nothing else seems to be a lag and everything else seems to be working fine. <clears throat> uh, it says there's living rock under, yeah. Living, 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 living. What's going on? It's not even using any mana. Like, it's just eating my diamonds and stuff. Hold on here. Let's... Put the plate down. Okay. Put the sparky spark on it. Okay, we're gonna try this one more time. Something's not right. Something is seriously not right. Uh, 
I don't know what's going on. Hold on. The only thing, okay, the only thing different now than what normally is going on is that magma torch. I'm wondering, I it shouldn't, but who knows? I'm gonna go take down the magma torch and just see if that might be having some really weird effect on stuff. Um, I, you know what? I need to go grab diamonds because I've thrown all three of mine in there. And I should have quite a few in here now. Oh yeah, I got quite a few. Eventually I'm going to need 24, so let me just grab 24. Because we're going to be optimistic that this is going to work. Because I hate when I do every Like, I know when I make mistakes. That's understandable. But when I know I did everything right and it's still not working that is frustrating that is really frustrating okay yeah whole bunch of mana diamonds there we go just double check I'm not missing something that's a mana diamond that's a mana steel ingot and that's a mana pearl yeah shift for the recipe it's easy pearl in there yeah gotcha and same with you just yeah yeah mm -hmm. not missing anything here yeah okay got it all okay mm. what is going on This is frustrating me. This should be working. I've done this before. It's not even touching the mana. That pool is full. You guys are definitely connected. What is going on? I'm wondering... Oh, okay. Here's a concept. Because of all this other living rock, let, let's see if that could possibly be affecting it. I, I'm going for anything now. Like, absolutely anything. Totally get in the way anything else that could interfere with it. Okay. You are totally good to go here. We're going to do this. I'm going to pick this whole plate up again. I'm going to get it all set up nice and neat. There we go. Okay. Here we go. This is going to work. I'm optimistic that this is so going to work right now. You go there. You go there. You guys are definitely linked. That is 100% definitive a connection. On both sides. Let's get to going. Oh. I saw particles going that time. Okay, it's taking mana. It took a little bit of mana. And then stopped. I don't have to be in the area, do I? No, that doesn't that wouldn't make sense. How did a zombie get loose? Oh, it's nighttime. Oh man, I just screwed myself. I so just screwed myself um, because I didn't pay attention to the fact that nighttime had fallen and now my whole world is going to be freaking, yep, mobs central. Well, fortunately, all I'm going to have to do is kill the ones with armor and creepers and all that when, wow, they're just everywhere. They're just everywhere. This is, this is so upsetting because...
it's it's pulling it in and then not doing it it's taking a little bit of mana and then that's it what is going on and after a whole bunch of research i remembered one thing i know exactly where they're at they're in this chest over here because i have a hopper hawk floating right here Oh my goodness, I could not for the life of me figure out why this was failing. It didn't make any sense for it to be failing. And it's okay. I've got that off. Look at all the stone down here. Because my hopper hawk has been picking it up. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, we're getting it done now. Poof, poof, poof. Oh yeah. I'm going to go ahead and make another mana pool. Um, or bring another mana pool up. So we can try to get this done as fast as possible. Um, I'm going to need some more living rock. Hey, come on. Go. Go. Oh, my goodness. That was so frustrating. I was just like, oh, I know what it is. I couldn't figure out. It just, oh, that was done fast. I may not need the other pool. That was pretty quick. That was a lot faster than I thought it was going to be. Terra Steel. Okay, and that did drain half a tank, didn't it? Yep. Along with the mana that I wasted trying it. Um, where's my hand? Hand of Ender. Let me see here. I go ahead and transfer mana from another pool. Are you sparing? <clears throat> yes, you're sparing. Okay. Oh my goodness, that was so frustrating. So very frustrating. Come on, keep going, keep going. I was like, a tablet holds like half by itself, right? Uh, uh, apparently it holds almost an entire pool. Cool. All right. So let's go ahead and do this. And reverse the process. There you go. Loan it out. And let's go ahead and... Where are my diamonds at? There they are. If anything, at least I'll be able to get my... Um, oh, what's it called? My sword today. And then... Actually, I'll probably have my full armor pretty quickly. That shouldn't be an issue. Are you still donating to the cause? It's funny because you're taking and adding at the same time. Come on. Come on. Yeah, you're done. Okay. Okay. Let's go get more mana from one of the... Oh, there it is. Oh, this is awesome. Uh, reverse process. And go ahead and soak you up. And we'll go craft a sword real quick. I'm not really sure if it's better or not. I mean, it's all really like enchantable and stuff like that. But I really like my sword. Um, but at the same time... I'm not going to pass up on uh, it's two, yeah. And like that. So what are the stats on this? It's seven to start. Mine is currently 12, but this one does something that I love. Every so often it zaps and you can shoot. That's freaking cool. That is so cool. So we should have all of our armor done today. And then, next episode, we will start getting ready for the elven stuff. Because that's, I mean, that's just obviously next on next on tap. It's the obvious next progression. Because I want to get some stuff done. Um, there we go. So yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Because, I mean, that's, that's a wrap. We, we've got it. Um... After a whole lot of frustration with that stinking, freaking, no good, whatchamacallit, um, Hopper Hawk, we've got it going. Okay, you full, or not full, but half. Bink, bink, bink. There we go. And if there's a quicker way to do this, it'd be awesome. It says to do more sparks, so possibly I could do that later and do more sparks. But anyways, um, you guys, guys, <clears throat> oh, you know what? One thing I'll show you. This is becoming a really long episode again. It's not what I wanted, but um, I've 
part of this was I wanted power. I wanted power and I wanted a way to distribute it. And so the power wires, I think, just look kind of cool and I can run these around and it looks like a normal neighborhood, right? That I thought was pretty cool. But I needed power and the, my lava generators just weren't cutting it anymore. So I got into big reactors and where we did uh, kill the wither last time to get the wither star, I've cleaned it up relatively, but I have uh, started my very first big reactor. And as you can see, it's putting out a ton of power and it sits pretty neutral. I mean, it's it's generating more than I can use, but if I, uh, if I just take it down even one step, um, then it's using too much. Nope, 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 that's still good. Can I take you down anymore? I'm trying to use as little material as possible. Nope, still not. I'm not using a lot of energy right now, apparently. Still not? Wow. All right, this has helped me save a lot of energy. I mean, my RF per ticks are way down, but I, it's not using it, it's not using it. Um, but it's not using a lot of the yellow, whatever it's called, yellow amium. Jeez, I'm really not using any energy at all right now. This is smart just to turn it off. Wow, this is probably the most efficient. Oh, oh, wrong way. That is crazy. There we go, now it's going down. Okay, so we'll t kick you up one notch. Took me down to freaking 80% off to do that and now you're going back up right yep all right cool and 53 runoff got stacked stack and a quarter so yeah so we've got plenty of power uh big reactors they're awesome and i'm planning on going pretty big but i think uh, the last millennium is gonna be my power station I just kind of want it out of sight and stuff like that. And since I can transfer all the power with Tesseracts, it, it just makes sense. So um, so I'm going to go finish making all of my Terra Steel. And when we come back next time, I will have my full Terra Steel armor. Um, I'm not going to be able to do it all right now, but I'll be able to get a lot of it done right now. So until next time, guys, you know the deal. I'm Slutter Havoc. This is Sky Factory, and I'm out of here. Peace.